Well, we want to continue to talk a little bit about the One Thing Conference that's coming up. Misty, we are really locking in as a leadership team here at the IHOP um, Missions Base because we are in one of the most, well, I would say the most significant season in 10 years. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I would agree with the whole justice initiatives coming to the to the surface. We're, we're ramping all of that up to a whole new level since the 10-year anniversary. Um, I would say we're in definitely one of the most significant seasons. Right. And a lot of you know that at the 10-year anniversary, we got together in our little 1,500-seat sanctuary about, about 3,000. Yeah. It was really claustrophobic. We jammed in, in which I would call our most significant moments hour in 10 years and we all made a solemn commitment to combine 24 hour prayers for justice with 24 hour works of justice because we're launching a lot of evangelism a lot of initiatives praying for the sick out in the community prophesying a lot of compassion works reaching out to those that are caught and trapped in human trafficking and and we're starting in uh, orphanages we're involving ourselves in adoption. I mean, we've started adoption agencies and a lot of aggressive outreaches into our community. We're uh, asking the Lord for ways and we're getting some insight on how to get in involved in our school systems and the leadership of it. Our city council, I mean, IHOP is going out yeah. and the Holy Spirit's telling us it is time to confront the compromise and the rise of darkness that's emerging in the church to respond to the Holy Spirit and the crisis that's in the land, but much more than that, there's a whole lot of positive because we're, we're in a season where the Holy Spirit is, well, actually the season has been 2000 years. He's anointing his people to do the works of the kingdom. If they want to do the works of the kingdom, they want to heal the sick, they want to prophesy, they want to win the lost, they want to be involved in an active way in compassion, they want to impact society, now's the time, yes, we are contending for a great breakthrough in the future, but there is a breakthrough already available through the new covenant and, the, and just the Holy Spirit availability right now. So we're doing the stuff now. We're calling people to do the stuff now, actively engaged while contending in the place of prayer for the historic breakthrough that goes beyond the book of Acts. So it's the now and the great breakthrough. That's what we're aiming for while recognizing there's a great conference, I mean, a great crisis in the nation. And so, man, we're doing all of this together. And the Lord's given us a lot of clarity of one, two, three, four, what the Spirit is saying, both the positive and the negative. And that's what we're addressing in this conference. Yeah, I'm excited to see that the Lord is really stirring up the, the desire for impact. It's always in the hearts, especially of young people of 18, 19, 20 year olds, the desire for impact and the desire to change the world. Today at the beginning stages, that seed of the revival that's gonna come in the end times, we're in the beginning stages of that and we wanna buy into it and get to doing the stuff. I'm excited to see what God is doing. Yeah, the, I'd say the last 10 years, if I've been, uh, you know, as, as a pastor, been paying attention, there's been a new marked interest in young people. I, I'd say it's about 10 years. We got to get involved in acts of compassion. We've got to get involved in works of justice. We got to release the power of the spirit today. We want to win the loss now, but we want to prepare for the unique things that are coming in the generation of the Lord returns that are just still some decades away. So there's this tension of acting fully in faith now, engaged fully in the culture now, but contending in fasting and prayer for a revival that will surpass the book of Acts, going deep as a forerunner so we have clarity in the word for the unique dynamics of the generation of the Lord returns while confronting the crisis in the church of compromise and the crisis in our nation that's coming out of uh, our government policies that are encoding so much liberal darkness. This, this is actually a great time to be alive. It's a, it's a dangerous time if you're not walking with the Holy Spirit or if you're not paying attention. Many negative things are being set into motion, but many powerful things are being released as well. So we want you to come. We Again, we believe this is the most significant season for IHOP, and we're gonna be sharing what the Holy Spirit's telling us. But more than that, what we think he's saying to the church in our nation. And so it's important that you, if you're gonna come, Last four days of December, you know that everything is absolutely free. We have a four day conference. 
right after it is a leadership conference. I mean, so four days, December 28, 29, 30, 31st, we take one day off, January 1st. Take a deep breath because we stayed up till midnight the night before and been going four hard days. Then we're going right into a leadership conference. And we're aiming at those that are church planters, uh, those that are leading congregations, those that are building church ministries, campus ministries. We're really aiming at leadership. That's absolutely free of charge as well. But we need you to sign up on the website. And here's why. If you will register and we get a real number, it saves us so much money because what typically happens is we go by the registered number, then a bunch come at the end, so we gotta double the, the space. We gotta run around and get more lighting, we gotta get more sound equipment. It's so much more expensive for us. But we, but we don't wanna overdo it and pay for space we don't need. So we really need an accurate count and for the leadership conference as well. The hotel uh, uh, costs right now are discounted. The, the hotel is saying, we're gonna give you a window of time, and it's right now, we will give you lower prices because they want the security of knowing they're going to fill their hotels. That, therefore, they're dropping the prices now. If you plan to come, I urge you to sign up. Sign up for the hotels now. Get those discount prices. Save us money by so we get the real number. And, and, and join us in December. Our, our uh, primary leadership team at IHOP, we're going on a 21-day fast. At November 30th, for 21 days through the month of December, stopping just in time for Christmas, and we're coming to this conference, the whole leadership team with a fiery spirit, with a sense of clarity and destiny and faith for what's coming. So uh, I wanna encourage you to pass the word on to a friend. If you know anybody that loves Jesus and they wanna be involved in this kind of thing, send this uh, podcast to a friend. Uh, just, you know, just get them hearing this because we think that this, the move of God that's coming is far beyond even just house of prayer type people. Anybody that loves Jesus, that wants to encounter God, do the stuff and change the world. We'll see you next time.